Good morning, friends. So today is uh, Thanksgiving for you in the United States, um, and we don't celebrate it. But I want to say to you all, Happy Thanksgiving. Um, today I just have to go to school for, uh, like I told you before, for a little uh, appointment with my student counselor, and um, after that's done, I might go to Primark for a little bit. I uh, still want to look for a sweater, a nice sweater and uh, they usually have cheap and nice stuff uh, so I'm going to look there and maybe for some presents for uh, 5th of December then we have Santa Claus in the Netherlands um, and we just gonna do uh, the dice game uh, it means that you have to get two little presents of under the five euro, uh, which is fun for everybody. Um, and one thing from your house that you don't want to have anymore, so... Um, I don't know, you can give anything. And then you have... Uh, everybody does that, so you're with a little group, and then you have two dices, and... Um, or one, and then you have to roll the dice and each number stands for something. For example, six is pick a present, um, three is exchanges with somebody else, um, or uh, one is exchanges with the person left to you, things like that. It's really fun and you end up with gifts um, that you wanted to have or maybe you didn't want to have it. For example, you have like first round, then it's all wrapped up, and after that, so then you still have like no idea what you get. Usually, people go for the biggest thing, for example, and then after that, uh, after the first round, then second round, everybody unwraps their gift, so then you know what it what's in it, and then you know that, for example, there's like a really great gift. And you see that everyone, everybody wants to try and get that one. Um, so yeah, that's a lot of fun always. And we are going to do that on the 1st of December. Um, for people who don't know, uh, I am religious. Um, and I don't really push push my beliefs onto some somebody else I just res respect everybody their um, decision or opinion and um, uh, in my church it is that if you want to get baptized you do it on uh, the age where you want to do it so we don't baptize people as um, babies they do get blessed but um, they can make their own decision on a later age so for me that's now and um, I'm gonna get baptized on the 1st of December and I know for people who don't believe uh, it might be weird or something but for me it means a lot so I just want to put that out there and share it with you guys and yeah that's that and um, that's gonna happen Sunday and then um, after that we just have church and after that those uh, like a couple of friends and family are go gonna come over and we're gonna play that game so that will be fun and I still have to find gifts for that uh, so we'll just have to look around in the city on Saturday and maybe today I can find something fun as well for example like a pair of socks and gloves make it like a little set with a head things like that so I'll just look for that and I will see you guys later I'm just gonna make some yummy lunch now bye and my dad made chocolate cake and it looks yeah? yummy it kind of needs yeah, it And that looks yeah. good. So today I'm having lunch. Nice little bread from yesterday. And I'm making some um, cream cheese with, uh, I don't know what's this. 
Gislok. Yeah, I don't know the English name. And I'm just with classic cream cheese. So I'm gonna put some more in there and mix it up and it's yummy. And in the meanwhile, my dad is uh, making ras raspberry sauce. He's just uh, squashing down some frozen raspberries now. Four on the chocolates. chocolate cake. Yummy! And something is laying around. Hey guys, so I just came back uh, from the train and from the Primark and before that school um, okay. and I went to school because um, I have uh, dyslexia and I got a delay in my study and in the Netherlands um, when you go to school um, like college or university the government uh, pays for well it doesn't pay for it you get a certain amount of money depending on how much your parents earn and if you don't earn too much each month and depending on that you get a certain amount of money each month um, to pay your school for some people who have like uh, parents who earn quite a lot um, they get only the basic which is 90 euros and for people who don't earn that much for example my parents don't earn that much you get more so you get on top of the basic you get extra money and this is the money that you're supposed to use for school and books things like that for school um, if you don't live with your parents anymore and you live uh, on your own then you even get an extra amount of money uh, for you to be able to pay the rent because um, they know it's difficult for students to end study and uh, pay rent like pay your study pay your rent and work at the same time so um, by doing this the students still has to work for a part of it but um, the government helps out and then um, you don't get it for free you have to graduate um, and get your diploma and once you did that then you um, get the money that they gave you they uh, give it as a gift and if you don't graduate if you just decide to quit halfway or at the end without getting a diploma um, and there is a limit you have to get your diploma within 10 years they want to lower that as well um, but if you don't do that then you have to pay everything back and uh, for example you also get like public transport and you can choose um, weekdays or in the weekend and um, if you don't um, graduate or something then you have to pay for it's about 97 euro for each month that you had it and usually you get it for four years and if you um, study longer like if you study five years you have to uh, pay for the fifth year yourself and then um, there's this other thing for people who have like um, something uh, yeah for example dyslexia or um, what else if you have are uh, disabled and it um, yeah how does 
do you say it? If that interrupts with your study and if that causes a delay in your study, then um, you can get an extra year. So I have a delay because of my dyslexia and, and because of that it's pretty hard for me to do other um, uh, languages and I do my whole study is in English so my my normal language is Dutch so for me English is already a bit harder and then I have Japanese as language as well um, and I'm not that good at Japanese and because of that I got a delay of about a year now and today I had to talk with um, my counselor because the counselor decides if you're get it, getting it or not like the extra year um, so he agreed with me that it's all because of my dyslexia that I have like a delay in my study and um, now I just have to fill in some papers and um, if everything goes right then the government helps me another year to pay for my studies and um, I'm really glad about it because all the things that come with my study are really expensive and um, I know I can pay for it if I just look at my job um, but all the extra things that come with it are so expensive so I'm really happy that um, I might get it as a gift so now I'm just having dinner and I had a talk yesterday uh, no today um, and now I'm just having some mushroom soup that my parents made and it looks really really yummy with some bacon in it and some baguette and I'm probably gonna eat some pizza after that and I don't know if I'm gonna do a Primark haul in this video or in a separate video uh, but if I do then I will link you to it and I will let you guys know so bye and my dad decided it was a good idea to put a uh, frozen pizza in the microwave <laughs> so it burned right away and now I don't have a pizza so I'm just having some more baguette with um, garlic butter thing it's really yummy but a bit smelly but still really yummy and my mom just brought me the dessert uh, they are having a lot of friends over downstairs so that's why I'm eating upstairs and I have chocolate raspberry cake with a uh, raspberry sauce whipped cream and some mint so let's dig in Hey guys, so I'm really bad at planning. I started homework a couple of hours ago and I thought it would take one hour. And in the meanwhile, it's already three hours later. Um, so, and I still didn't finish it. But I'm going to bed now because I have to get up early tomorrow. And hope I can still, hope I still can finish it in the morning. And then I have school and in the meanwhile, uh, another vlog is exporting and from work I did this for Japanese I still have to do this part but I wrote it down somewhere else did those did this uh, then I did that I still have to do those too and I did all these so I did do quite a bit but it takes me a lot of time because I suck at Japanese um, so yeah I'm trying to do that tomorrow morning so I hope you all are having a great day today with Thanksgiving and everything and I'll see you guys tomorrow bye